Oh my god, look at you, superhero queen. Oh my god. Our glowing swords. I am so sorry. The glowing swords took me by surprise. I was not expecting that. That was amazing. YouTube. My name is Cezro and welcome back to the 100 Baby spin-off where I follow the lives of my kids from the 100 Baby Challenge and it's been a while but I'm happy to say that we are back with my girls Molly and Lacey who currently live in Del Sol Valley because Molly's aspiration is to become a master actor but she's evil and hot-headed and then she's dragged her sister Lacey along for the ride. Now Lacey is in the business career, she is a queen, absolutely killing it in the business career. Both of the girls are actually killing it in their careers actually. They're both at level 9. In the last episode of the 100 Baby spin-off we had two gigs from Molly, one of which was a movie. It was her first ever movie. She wasn't quite prepared for it though and she literally stabbed herself in the foot. And then the other one was a TV show that was amazing. We also got her an audition for the same movie that she literally stabbed herself in the foot in. She passed that audition but now she's level 10 in acting so she's a little bit more prepared. So in this episode, she's going to go to that gig. She's hopefully going to get to level 10 of the acting career and Lacey will hopefully get to level 10 of the business career as well. So it's all really exciting, but let's dive into the game and see where we're at with the girls. It is Monday morning and Molly's gig is tomorrow at 9 o'clock in the morning. It is of Tea and Treachery. That is the name of the movie. So today we've got to get her to practice dramatic scenes, which we can do now. We're going to get her to develop the charisma skill and research a flirty emotion. And then after she's done those things, we're going to get her working on other skills. She's going to get to level 10 of the career after this gig. Like that's going to happen. But I want her to star in a movie of all the different genres of movie that she can star in. That's the end goal for Molly. And then Lacey, she is level 9 of CEO. She's got to get to level 8 of Logic. I have given her today off so that she can get to level 8 of Logic. And then from tomorrow, she's going to be working hard and she will make it to the end of the business career in this episode. It's really exciting. But let's get the day started. We will call over her cast members to do practice dramatic scenes and research the flirty emotion as well. Well, it'll be interesting to see who her co-stars are and whether they actually arrive today. Oh, is this one of them? Jim Tanner. <gasps> Jim Tanner. I have a bone to pick with Jim Tanner because Jim Tanner has a really deep voice, but he completely stuffed up our movie scenes last time and it was due to him I truly believe it was due to him stuffing up the movie scenes that we didn't get gold the last time we did this movie so I got a bone to pick with you Jim I do so we're gonna practice dramatic scenes okay we're halfway done we've got to do one more dramatic scene so let's do it let's get it done Molly and then we can send Jim Tanner home and hope that he's going to perform better on our movie tomorrow Gypsy do a Bakishla. Uh-uh. <gasps> See? That! <laughs> Jim Tanner, I swear to freaking God, Jim Tanner, if you cannot get your act together in this movie gig tomorrow, I'm going to be furious at you. That is exactly what he did in the movie last time. Oh my God. Isn't it just so annoying when things go wrong and it's not your fault at all? It's lucky I didn't send Jim Tanner home because we're going to need you, Jim. Even though I'm incredibly annoyed at you, I need to do some friendly, flirty interactions first. And then we'll see how we go. Why is he dazed? What is going on with you, Jim Tanner? See, you liked the rose, but why are you not liking your acting job? You're the thing you have to do in your acting. All right, that should be it for him. You're done, Jim Tanner. I'm done with you. Jim, please be better tomorrow. I'm praying that you're actually going to help us get this and have it go well. But we're gonna get her to do a no sweat run just to work on that fitness skill, get it up to level seven so that we can then after this gig, hopefully get a fitness movie. That'll be really good. <laughs> or a movie that requires the fitness skill, I'm sorry. She's like staring into my soul, Molly. Are you, are you okay, Molly? You're scaring me a little bit, Molly. 
Can you just imagine this chasing you down the street? Like she's just looking at you like that, just chasing you down the street. Oh, there we go. A change in her facial expression. Thank God. Oh, nope. It's back. <laughs> There we go. She's made it to level seven. Hell yes. So we will now be prepared if we get the option to do a movie that requires fitness. We can now do that. That'll be great. Lacey's nearly made it. 2% to go. So she's just made it, which is amazing, meaning she can go to work tomorrow. She can work hard and get it going. Best send the girls off to bed though, so that we can get this gig happening for my Molly tomorrow and Lacey off to work. It's very exciting. I'm super excited. The next morning. She's wearing her gold outfit. Yes, Molly, my queen. I love it. Sparkling style from clothing item. This outfit sparkles as much as Molly's personality. Damn right it does. That is so cool. I love that. All right, the time has come. I'm really excited. Please, I'm praying. We're going to join Molly for her gig. Here we are at the studio. Righty oh. So, we've got to... Post a Simstagram story, practice acting, get into hair and makeup, and complete the performance. Let's post a Simstagram story because we're here and we can do that. That's super easy. We've got so many elders on the lot now. That's how long we've been playing this. My God. Perfect. So now we can go and practice acting in her dressing room mirror because she's got her own fancy dressing room right here. So let's go and do that. Go and practice your acting. All right, Lacey's off to work. We're going to get her to... Oh, she's already working hard because she's a queen. There we go. Now we can tell the director we're ready. All right, we are ready. So we got the shouting scene, the perform share drink scene, and the flirt scene. They're the first one. So we're going to start over here. Let's do Risky Have a Drink With because she's got the charisma that she needs. Jim, Jim, can you please? Although I think Jim's in the opposite role to what he was last time. Philippe, Jamal of Ubrish. Yab Sapola, dude. She should be. Yep, Sims. Yep, Sims. Denied. <sighs> Hell yes. Okay, so we've now got the perform hug scene in there. So we're going to do a risky shout forbidden words because she's got like all of the acting skills. So we can should be able to do a risky. It should work out fine for us. Harsh of Yova, Yumpy, Nargawamba boy. Oh, neep, 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 doofka. Oh. Okay, so the sword fight scene's just turned up and that's what this is. So we can do the risky sword fight. I'm, I'm praying. I'm praying that this is going to be fine. It should be because, again, we've got the full acting skill. So it should be okay. Darboy. Chimene. Already looking a lot better than it was last time. Yes, Molly Queen. Okay, so that's fantastic. We're already doing better than we were last time. So we've got hug scene and flirt scene. Who are you? Shree! <gasps> Shree! That's Shree! He was our co-star on all the TV shows. He must have been promoted to a movie star as well. Shree, congrats, my dude. That's exciting. We've had a really good history with Shree, so I'm... I'm hopeful that this is going to be good. We're going to do a risky hug over here, though. Is that with Shree? Yes, it is. Okay, we should see if this is going to work. The hug was fine. It was the flirt that didn't work out last time. So this should hopefully be fine. Oh, oh. Dag, dag. All right, risky flirt. We're gonna do it because we researched the flirty emotion. It should be fine. I'm praying. Please let this work. Please. I'm scared. Please, Shree. Nubu, the love for baby. Oh, ah. Nubu. Yipsy. Okay, so maybe it was the flirt scene that went fine, but the kiss scene that didn't. I don't know, but we're going to do a risky kiss. We've made it to gold, though. I didn't even realize when did that happen, but we've made it to gold, so it really doesn't even matter what happens with this. Oh, my God. I'm so excited now. Yes, Molly. Gold on your movie. Yes. Do what? Shree is amazing. I love Shree. He's so good. 
Yes, Shree. Thank you, dude. I love it. Right, she's made it. She's gold. She's a freaking queen. I love her to pieces. Maybe she'll get nominated for an award this time. I'm really hoping because apparently it is dramatic movies or dramatic things that get you nominated for an award. So I'm, I'm please let her be nominated for an award. That'd be really great as well. <laughs> That's a wrap. So let's get her eating. We'll get her into a new gig as well, into a new audition anyway. See what we can do for the next movie. Radio. Oh my God. All the things are happening. So that's a wrap. Molly has finished all her scenes. The crew is shutting down. The footage is being sent to editing. She earned 8,320 simoleons. She gained quite a bit of fame. We're going to stay on this lot because she's been promoted to a silver screen icon. This is the highest career level in the acting career. So she has made it. She's level 10 of the acting career that is amazing so let's see what the go is with that molly's name will forever be known in film history her projects will be reviewed by film students for decades to come her subtle facial movements to portray complex emotions will be diligently studied by novice actors everywhere also molly will make a lot of money <laughs> she's unlocked superhero costumes sci-fi costumes and superhero headquarters stage that's really really exciting i cannot wait to see what gigs we're going to be able to get we've done detective law we've done dignity and decorum we've done making music we've done dead sea adventures oh okie dokie so tournament of honor is another movie it is another charisma movie though i kind of want to skip over that to go with a fitness level seven movie so captain sigma olympus landing it sounds like it's going to be a superhero movie looking for a strong commanding lead to play the iconic captain sigma well my molly is strong and commanding and she's definitely iconic so <laughs> let's go for it captain sigma so let's do it so the audition is tomorrow night night at 7 o'clock p.m. She's already at fitness level 7, meaning that we'll have all day tomorrow work to work on the comedy skill and the music, like the guitar skill as well. All right, let's go home, Molly. Let's await your sister's arrival home. I don't think Lacey's going to make it to level 10 of the business career today, but hopefully tomorrow she will. Oh my god, that was so good. I feel so much better about that movie now. My Molly, she's a queen, an actual queen. She's amazing. Now that we're at level 10 of the acting career, I kind of want to see what movies there actually are so I can kind of figure out what movies we're going to be doing for the rest of this series. So just give me a couple minutes. I'll figure that out. I'll be right back. Five minutes later. We've done of Tea and Treachery, so we don't have to do that one again. We're doing Captain Sigma while well, we've got the audition from it. The other option we had in this go was Tournament of Honor, which is another charisma. So then the other three movies that there are are The Sheriff from Alpha Centauri, and then there's Maladies of the City, and then there's Treasures of Arbyville, and I don't know what skill that would require. The Sheriff from Alpha Centauri is a comedy movie. Then Tournament of Honor, we've seen, is charisma maladies of the city is also charisma and then treasures of arbyville is fitness so it does mean that for this gameplay we're probably not going to be doing tournament of honor because we've already done a charisma movie and it means we're probably not going to do maladies of the city either because we've already done a charisma movie and we're not going to do treasures of arbyville because we've, we're going to be doing a fitness movie with captain sigma so the only other movie we're going to be doing after captain sigma is going to be the sheriff from alpha centauri because it's comedy so it means that I don't have to work on the guitar skill anymore which is good to know I just have to work on the comedy and getting that up to level seven which we can definitely do especially with having tomorrow as well so hell yes let's get into it Lacey will be getting home in a minute I haven't looked at how far she is in the career so she didn't get promoted I didn't think she would let's see how far she is though oh she's about halfway I don't even know if she's gonna make it tomorrow Hey there, Ms. Platt. We felt you should know your performance was being heralded as spectacular. We honestly can't believe you're still with us. A legend like you. Not to be unprofessional, but uh, do you think I could get your autograph sometime? Oh, everyday extras. I love you guys. So I'm just getting Molly to work on the comedy skill. We've got like one and a half skill levels to go, so that's going to be fine. And then Lacey's just chilling out. She can have a chill night because she doesn't need to gain any more skills. She's just chilling because she's amazing. So I might just speed ahead. We'll bring on tomorrow. The next day.
So, I have just realized that Molly didn't get nominated for an award again, which I'm sad because it means she probably won't get nominated for another award and we missed out on our chance, but that's just how it goes sometimes, so it's fine. So, Molly's audition is 7 o'clock tonight. We're just going to be working on comedy all day for her, and then Lacey's got work in three hours, and hopefully she'll make it to level 10 today. Hopefully she will. I don't know. We'll have to wait and see. Oh, why are we having an offensive conversation? Hey, that's enough. Molly, apologize to your sister. I am so over it. <laughs> so over it. All right, we're going to get Lacey waiting outside to go to work now because I don't want to risk her getting even more angry than she already is from that offensive conversation that Molly was just reveling in. We are going to get Molly started on the comedy skill. Today is going to be like a really breezy day. We're just going to breeze through it until Lacey gets home from work. So I might skip ahead. I'll see you when Lacey gets home from work. Later. Lacey's about to get home from work. I don't think she's going to make it today. She had a rough start because she was angry when she went to work from Molly being... <laughs> that to her so i did get molly to 16 percent of level six of comedy she's eating dinner she's got to go to her audition in just over an hour lacy will be getting home any minute now yeah she didn't make it i didn't think she would so molly is off to the audition chookers honey chookers hope that it goes very well for you and lacy you can just chill my love my queen you should definitely make it tomorrow which will be incredibly exciting Lacey you've killed it okay Molly's about to get home from the audition has she made it I am hoping so she's passed okay this is amazing Molly you got the role as Captain Sigma the Captain Sigma comics are the source of many debates around the office we are extremely well prepared to defend your non-canon choices across all internet forums love that love that so let's find out what we need to do. So the gig starts at 9 o'clock a.m. on Friday. We've already developed a friendship with a co-star. So I'm really intrigued to see who the co-star is going to be. Maybe it'll be Shri again. I don't know. So we've just got to research the angry emotion, which is interesting. Get in an angry emotion and perform mean interactions. That should be really easy for my Molly. But we will call someone over because I don't want her to do that for Lacey. So we're going to develop her fitness skill as well, which is super easy. All of those things we will do tomorrow but we might get both of the girls off to bed now so that we can bring on tomorrow. Lacey's going to get promoted tomorrow. It's going to be really exciting, so let's get into it. 12 seconds later. Vanessa passed away. Oh, that's sad. Oh, she's sad from losing a friend. Today is your day, Lacey. I'm really excited for you. Oh, no, it's not. Okay, tomorrow's going to be Lacey's day because it's Harvest Fest today, which means she's not actually going to go to work today. That's interesting. I completely forgot about seasons impacting the game. We are still going to be able to do all of the things for Molly, so that's going to be fun. But Lacey's going to have a cruisy day. She's got the day off. She deserves it. All right, we are going to find someone to take out our anger on. Let's do it to this person. So let's get her into an angry mood. She can research the angry emotion. It's not going to happen. I don't know if she has to have her primary uh, mood be angry for this to work, but we're going to have a rude introduction to this person and see what happens. So I tried to make it work here, but it wasn't working because she wasn't angry. So then I tried to cure her other emotions so that angry could come through and that wasn't working. So then I tried something else to try and make the anger come through. This sad mood is getting in the way of her anger that she needs to develop. I'm trying to get her into a really angry mood by having an argument with this person so that it can then overtake the sadness because I've tried crying it out in her bed and it doesn't seem to be doing anything to get rid of the sadness. Vanessa died at a really bad time. Thanks, Vanessa. I really appreciate it. But see, it doesn't work because then she's... Oh my god, I don't know what to do. Because now she's confident. I mean, she won the fight, but she's also, like, he's in a really bad mood. And because she's evil, that makes her happy. So it's just not going to happen. I don't know. I don't know what to do now. Ugh. I need to get the fitness done first so that that's done at least. Oh, Shri. Oh, what a good guy. Hey, I heard you became enemies with Kokoma. That guy is a jerk. He is, isn't he, Shri? Even though it was totally not his fault. It was just my Molly being herself. Okay, we're going to get Molly to cry it out. I mean, she's in a good mood from eating now. How long? 
I mean, hopefully the anger will overtake all of that stuff. I don't know. But she's going to be crying it out. And it's going to probably be a late night so that I can try and get this for her. Because it's already 8 o'clock at night. God damn your evil nature, Molly, making things really difficult. You'd think that the hot-headed nature would help, but the hot-headed didn't even step in for that. She's tired. Far out. The only other option, I suppose, is to have her go to bed now and wake up super early in the morning to do it. But I don't know how she's going to wake up. We'll get her to sleep for a little bit, I think. And then we might wake her up. We are going to get Lacey to sleep, though, because her day is tomorrow. It's going to be happening. So I'll see you in a couple of hours when I decide to wake Molly up. Early the next morning. She's now sad because she had a bad harvest fest. Molly cried out, I do not have time for this. We got two hours until this gig, and I'm very stressed about it. Molly, get in your bed and cry. Okay, I need to be spying someone. We've got just our. We just got. We've got. Okay, who are you? Who are you? Are you? Are you my coworker? I don't know. You are the person that I started um, having an issue with yesterday. Molly, get out of bed. We're gonna get you in this angry emotion. Hell yes, let's come and do it. Let's uh, provoke. Let's insult face and chew out. And then we'll rant and rave, and that should be it. We should only need the four interactions. Get out here. You... Okay, we're, we've got just under an hour. She hasn't eaten. She hasn't had a shower. None of that stuff because this was the more important thing. Okay, she's done. Oh, my God, Molly, you are incredible. Thank you. Okay, we made it, though. We got all of the prep tasks done. Thank the heavens. I was very stressed about that. We're going to join her for this gig, and then Lacey goes to work in an hour. Oh, my God, that was very stressful. I did not like that at all. <laughs> very stressful. Um, she's got to tell a story, practice acting, get into hair and makeup. Okay, we can go and practice the acting now. We'll do it in her dressing room again. We can also calm her down, which is good. Let's do that. Try and calm yourself down so that we're not angry. And then we'll practice acting after that. I'm also not looking at this set because I do want to be surprised by it again. So I haven't looked at it yet. We've got Raylan as a co-star and it, Jim Tanner is our co-star. Okay, hmm, fun. I'm not looking forward to that. Ooh, we got a blue look. That's really interesting for Captain Sigma. Oh my god, Captain Sigma. I have a feeling I'm going to love this character. <laughs> this character is going to be amazing, I think. Let's get her into costume, though, and then we can finally see what the set's doing. <gasps> amazing Molly! Oh my god, look at you! <laughs> Superhero queen! Okay, so we've got to do a perform shouting scene, perform sword fight scene, which we've done a few sword fighting scenes now, and perform a kiss scene. They are the first scenes we will be doing. Let's have a look at our set. Oh my god, this is amazing! Molly! So let's see what the go is. Upstairs, we've got the risky kiss. Downstairs, we've got the sword fight. And we've got the risky shout forbidden words. I'm kind of nervous about this one. So let's do the risky shout forbidden words first. Get them out of the way. Let's get to it, Captain Sigma. You can do it, Molly. I believe in you. You look incredible. Dufka. <laughs> Quagga Farholz, Nargi, Nilsout Tiskaru. Okay, so we've got a fight scene as well. Is that just here? Okay, we'll do the risky fight as well. We've got level 7 of the fitness skill, so this should be perfectly fine. We should win this no problems. There should be no issues with this. Warning! <laughs> 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 Hell yes, Molly, you're killing it. Killing it. So what do we have? We've got the sword fight over here, so we might do that next. It also takes the fitness, so we should have no issues with this sword fight scene. It should be amazing. Oh my god. Our glowing swords. I am so sorry. The glowing swords took me by surprise. I was not expecting that. That was amazing. We're going to do the risky fire sim ray. The other angry thing that we did went really well with the risky thing. So we're going to do that really quick. So we're doing that with Raylan as well. Oh 
Molly, that look that she just gave the camera was amazing. Molly, you are incredible. We got one more scene to do, or maybe two, because this one, we, there should be another one after this. So we've got the risky kiss, though. Who are we? We're risky kissing Jim Tanner. That's making me very nervous because that historically has not gone well. So hopefully this will go well, but there should be another scene after this one anyway. So fingers crossed. Pakushla Nobo. Okay, that went well. Good, I'm glad to hear it. Good, we've got perform a share a drink scene, which is here. We've done that many times before, so hell yes, this should be great. We've made it as well, so again, amazing, my Molly. Well done, you. Yes, Molly killed it. Oh my god, amazing. Captain Sigma, she's very hungry though because she didn't get to eat before coming today. We'll find out how the gig went and hopefully we'll get the last gig that we need, which is the Sheriff of Alpha Centauri. That's the last gig that we're going to need. So hopefully we'll get that audition. Hopefully it'll be available for us. Flash her off. That's a wrap. Okay, she got 8,547 simoleons for that one. Gained a lot of fame. We're staying on the lot. She's become a rising star. She's a two-star celebrity. Killing it, my queen. She's got a little bit of a bad reputation, though, and that'll be from the fighting stuff that we had to do. I don't know. Anyway, from the mean interactions, I mean. She's got an enemy, that stuff, so that's not good. Let's find out what gigs we've got, though. Please, 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 let the Sheriff of Alpha Centauri, the Sheriff from Alpha Centauri is there. That is amazing. So it requires comedy level 7. We aren't there yet, but we can get there really quickly. So we're going to have that be the last gig. Fantastic. So that audition starts at 7 o'clock on Saturday. We're probably just going to go home and do some comedy for the rest of the day, working on that in preparation for that audition. Amazing. Our reputation's going down. I think I need to call our enemy over and patch it up because it's not looking good. It's, it's making our reputation go down. I don't want that. I'm slowly patching this relationship. <laughs> oh no, Shri, I know. Word on the street is that you've been getting in fights. You'd better clean up your act or you'll wind up with a terrible reputation. I know, I'm trying to. I am. Like, see, if you have a look at our relationship bar now, it's getting a little bit better because I've been sending texts and then slowly patching our relationship through sending texts. Oh my god, she's done it. Our Lacey has been promoted to a business tycoon. She's level 10 of that career. Let's see what is involved with that for her. So Lacey used to run a company and now Lacey runs several. Oh my god, she's a queen. Fortunately, she's got smart folks in key positions, so she's got more free time to enjoy life and the private jet. So she only works four days a week now. That's amazing. Oh, Lacey, queen, you've killed it. I'm so proud of my girls. They're both level 10 in their careers. You guys, that's actually where I'm going to end this episode of the 100 Baby spin-off. My girls are amazing. They're both level 10 in their careers. Molly's had two successful movie gigs and we've got one more that we're going to do. So in the next episode of the 100 Baby spin-off, it's going to be the finale for Molly and Lacey. We're going to have this last movie gig for Molly and then we're going to move them in with the rest of the family that is living in San Myshuno. So that's going to be really fun. But I hope that you enjoyed this episode of the 100 Baby spin-off. If you did and you'd like to see more of it and my 100 baby challenge as well hit the subscribe button down below and hit the notification bell next to it to be notified of every time that i upload and if you did like this video let me know by hitting the like button down below and leave me a comment as well but guys i hope you're having the greatest day ever and i will see you in the next video bye